and welcome to Audio Tree Live. Today is December 15th, 2017, and on this Friday afternoon, we're excited to welcome Prawn back to the studio. Let's hear your first song.
Diving like ducks in the sand Fighting all the flames to fan It's always right, brain first, left It's always right, brain first, left And there you stand Setting fire to sea, setting fire to me And there you stand Setting fire to sea, taking out Welcome back, you guys, and thanks so much to everyone for tuning in. Um, so you were actually here in Audio Tree in 2014, um, and if I remember correctly, the host Blake had asked you about March Madness, uh -huh. and you guys were <laughs> chatting. Actually, you had a different kind of bracket going that actually had to do with Kyle's interests. Yep. And uh, some of those interests were dark meat chicken, mm -hmm. cigarettes, and staring. Yeah. And so I thought actually just to, you know, kind of bookend the sessions, it would be fitting to have Kyle do his stare once again, again back yeah, into, the, that's a great idea. into the camera. Are oh, yeah. you prepared? I'm do you prepared. feel ready? Okay. Oh, yeah. All right. Do a good one. Which one? All right. <laughs> yeah, get a little <laughs> zoom in on that. So, so is staring still in your interests? I think it's kind of died down a little yeah, bit. Yeah, it's definitely died yeah. down a bit. Yeah. It was a phase. Okay, how else have your interests changed in that, um, in the, I guess, this three-year period i don't know not much i think it's kind of about the same besides staring so you're still into dark meat chicken <laughs> <laughs> i do love chicken okay that's good to know <laughs> also i noticed jamie you might actually really be into cc's pizza because <laughs> you have one of the best sound checks i've ever heard he just for those who aren't you know in on it he just repeats cc's pizza cc's pizza check check mix checks mix one two check. Czech Republic. So do you like buffets and snacks or like what? I can't take credit for it, unfortunately. A good oh. friend of mine named Casey from the famed <laughs> Flatliners uh, used the CeCe's Pizza thing. And I just thought it worked really well. It does. It but I played everything else on, like Czech Republic and everything else was, was mine. Okay, that's all yours. Have you actually been, has anyone here been to a CeCe's Pizza? Yeah, I think we I have. have. Once before. Once or twice. Yeah. I, I think it's just like Little Caesars, but well, I think is it it's different? Buf it's buffet style. Oh, so okay. if you're into so it's buffets, like it's like the Little Caesars. Yeah, essentially. Pizza Hut used to be buffet style, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's actually one in Chicago that's still buffet style. So if you guys want to hit that up, I can give you the exact address after. <laughs> or if you want to go to CC's Pizza. Or maybe like a KFC. I think we're going to splurge maybe. on Demos. 
All right, oh, perfect. Yeah. Whatever. Take yeah, none of my suggestions. Yeah, yeah. I, I I appreciate that. I respect that. Well, let's uh, enough about food. Let's hear some more music when you're ready. You ready, JJ? second song you're rocking so hard that your like headphones just did like one of these yeah, I kinda did, like, a do you want to just do you want to do the whole session that way honestly <laughs> if it wasn't so precarious i'm just terrified you know yeah 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 well i think <laughs> it's a testament to you know how hard you guys are jamming right now which is awesome you guys are from new jersey correct me if i'm wrong yep. uh, who but none of you seem to really have jersey accents that's a good thing if you had to pick one band member that had the most New Jersey accent, it would be you? Yeah, probably. Okay, can we just go around? I want to, like, have you guys each say a phrase that I think would sound New Jersey, and then I'll decide. New Jersey phrase. Or you guys pick the phrase, but I think down by the shore would be, like, a good one. If we all say down yeah, by just the say, shore? Yeah, say down by the shore. 
Now I'm just going to work on my enunciation. <laughs> now I got to... Down by the shore. That was just regular. <laughs> yeah, that sounded oh, pretty... I thought, oh, I thought you... No, no. To sound the least Jersey. Oh. Oh, I don't know. I might, I don't know to I might a slip a like Boston accent. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to do... Down by the shore. A, you're a, a, Down. Do you know <laughs> that does sound Boston. <laughs> Am I putting you guys on the spot too much? No, I just no. don't know what to... Down by... Yeah. I think I think you have to cut out <laughs> like the word the by like it's just like down, down the, the shore. shore yeah yeah down the shore down the shore New Jersey down the shore yeah. down the shore yeah. I actually okay I got to give Ryan then the credit on that one because I feel like he really just brought everyone in and nailed it. Forget about it. Do That's you, good. Forget about it. Do you feel like when you go home to Jersey, maybe your New Jersey accent comes out a little bit more if you're around people who have it? We have one friend that I will not name in New Jersey. That we've been friends with him for 15 years, and he's getting really bad with it. Uh, and we like see the progression. We're probably gonna have to say something soon to him because it's, it's getting. It's, yeah, it's getting unbearable. You have to have a, a New Jersey accent intervention. Yeah. How do you even approach that conversation? Like, I don't know. That's a really. It's tough. It's tough. <laughs> well, I just wonder because you know Chicago, we're known for our like mom, dad, whatever. And when I'm around my family at home, it definitely comes out more. So. I was just curious, hmm. New Jersey wise. Maybe, I, I maybe my mom has it pretty bad. Yeah. Not pretty bad. She just has a slight <laughs> Jersey accent. I love it. I like Jersey. Yeah. Speaking of New Jersey, I went k down kind of a rabbit hole um, in New Jersey research, and I found this place called Wawa, mm -hmm. which was like a convenience store in the 90s. Is that still, still around? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Wawa's a big thing. They're Do going you nationwide now, too. Oh, they are? Yeah. I was checking out their signage. I was like, why don't we have this here? It's a really great concept. I mean, Wawa's you, are pretty good. I mean, yeah. Pretty I, just, pretty I don't good. think you have it because there's other places that are just better. And that's and we're going to catch a lot of flack for that. But You uh, are hating on Wawa <laughs> right now? It's just people really idolize it. And, like, you know, I don't think it deserves <laughs> uh, the, like, untouchable reputation that it gets. Because let me tell you, that reputation's touchable. It's, yeah. It's like there's a lot of a lot of points that they really fall short on. Like their bread is just bad. We hope no one from Wawa is watching. This, <laughs> is <here>. watching right <laughs> now. Or, this or has also come from the guy that gets grits at Waffle House. Yeah. Uh, oh, fair. Yeah. Good one. Well, if Wawa is watching, I think you can reach out to Ryan. He'll um, give you some pointers on how to better to bake your bread. Yeah. How to better bake your bread. I'd love to talk to corporate. <laughs> Great. Let's hear some more music.
Like 75% of our interview has been dedicated to just food. <laughs> um, so I thought we would talk about uh, fashion instead. Okay. Um, so what were some of the worst 90s trends that you participated in uh, fashion-wise? Or did you not participate in any 90s, 90s trends? 90s trends. Um. Or if fashion is too uh, non band like we can go with any 90s trend I, my I, I definitely had some of those like zip off uh, cargo shorts you know like the I convertible like oh, yeah. yeah that's that's probably my uh, like biggest faux pas but you know I feel like those were so functional though I mean they were <laughs> we should bring those back <laughs> one day I was an aggressive inline skater oh that was hell 90s. Yeah. yeah I feel like that's not something to be embarrassed of though oh, that's I got, pretty embarrassing I got an embarrassing one I had the blonde tips. Oh, oh frosted wow, tips. Yeah. Wow. yeah. Cool. Did you also... <laughs> you knew so, that. So you, like, gelled them. Yeah, I was... I don't remember how old I was. I was pretty young, though, when I had it done. Yeah. It's pretty bad. I had the... It's pretty bad. Janko pretty jeans. Bad. Oh, Janko? Yeah, oh, yeah. I had those. Yeah. I got all my brother's hand-me-downs, and they were, like, skaters, you know, that whole thing. So I had a bunch of No Fear shirts. Oh, nice. Mm. Yeah, and Stussy. Remember Stussy? Yeah. yeah, oh yeah. Yeah. Stussy. I always thought it was called Stussy. Oh, maybe that is right, and I'm fucking it up. I don't know. But I also just saw the new Fargo, and Stussy's in that, so I could be confusing. I don't know. Maybe chime in on Audio Tree Live in the comments and let us know. <laughs> how to pronounce it? How to pronounce it. It'd be kind of difficult. Also, let us know your thoughts on Wawa uh, okay. while you're at it. That's gonna, <laughs> there's a big argument of Wawa versus Sheets, so that's going to... Wait, what is it? Sheets? What's, yeah, what's Sheets? That's it's the other like a Wawa. Okay. Uh, it's like Wawa's uh, Microsoft, Sheets is Apple. So it's like uh, a serious debate. Okay. Yeah. But that, back in good, the 90s good for that. Yeah. Got yeah, it. Like Apple. Oh, I don't know. Never mind. 
Well, we won't go down that road right now. Okay, well, let's bring it to present day, though. So you guys, 2017, new record out. Yep. Uh, run. Mm -hmm. What is one fun fact or something that would surprise people about the making of this record? Um, it, it could be different for each of you, too. I take care of dogs when I'm home. Like, I board dogs. So the dog on the front cover is my favorite dog that I ever boarded. What's and his his or her name? Fritz. Fritz. Come on, full German name. short hair pointer. Give, give it the full name. Well, that's his full name. What's his last name? Fritz Mueller, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fritz Mueller. Heinz <laughs> Fritz Mueller. <laughs> that's classic. Anyone else? Favorite things about the record? Fun facts? Yeah, Ryan tracked the bass uh, wearing uh, pajama <laughs> pants, but they were... Like designed to look like jeans, but they were actually pajama pants. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say he um, tracked wearing his cargo shorts <laughs> that zipped. <laughs> they were very similar, very yeah. similar in the fashion. So that that'll sense. be in five years when you come back and do an audio tree. The 2017 trend that you participated in mm. will be those pants, right? Fair. Yeah, yeah fair. Okay, well, enough about uh, fashion. Let's hear another song.
You're watching Audio Tree Live with Pran. Thank you all so much for coming back. I'm glad we didn't scar you after the first visit. Thanks for having us. Yeah. Based on the second visit, do you think you'll ever return? Yeah, we'd love to. Hopefully <laughs> when I'm feeling a little better. Yeah, we hope you feel better. Hopefully Thanks. drink some tea, get some rest, yeah. you know. Yeah, we have nothing. I think we're going to go see Star Wars tonight. So oh, we'll hell yeah. Drink a lot of tea and... Nice. Yeah. Um, if you like what you heard, you can check out the band's new record, uh, Run, available on all outlets. And what's your website so people can go check out upcoming tour dates? Uh, Prawnmusic.com? Prawnmusic. Pr Pr Jamie? Maybe it's both. <laughs> Just Google it. Yeah, that's probably the best. Just Google Prawn Music. Not prawn, just prawn, because oh, you'll sure. get a lot of shrimp, <laughs> <laughs> right? Okay, we'd like to thank everyone in the studio today, the camera, lighting crew for hooking it up, and to you, our viewers. Stay tuned to the band's social media as well as ours for the session in a few weeks. And from everyone here at Audio Tree, we will see you real soon. Have a good weekend. Thank you very much, everybody. <laughs>